What's up guys, it's JBeebs here, and yes, 2020 has finally ended. It was pretty much a bad year overall, I mean, there was definitely some good moments, there was some bad moments, but I feel like that really is the way every year, however, there was, I feel like, more significant bad moments, but there were more good little moments, and one of those good moments was I started this channel. So basically in this video, I will be showing you all the analytical side of my channel through its existence to tw through 2020. So we got a total of 3.6 thousand views. And as you can tell, there is a huge spike around October 16th. And that is because, yes, I cheated. So basically, if you don't know how the YouTube algorithm works, if more people are watching your views, anyone who watches similar type of videos it will pop up in their feed so basically if you were to watch a bunch of Madden videos and this one Madden video that doesn't from a person who doesn't really have many many views many subscribers it for some reason starts picking up and more people are watching it and watching it and watching it and that's how these videos go viral so that's what I was essentially trying to do with some of my like bigger videos and as you can, you can go to my channel and look at the most viewed. I mean, majority of them aren't from me because I did I watched like every video. However, I did I did try to do this, but as you can see, watch time it wasn't really that high. I wasn't watching them for that long, but we did get a total of ninety eight point five hours throughout the year. This is honestly something I did not expect to be that high. As you can see, even whenever I was watching all those videos. I wasn't really watching them for that long because I just skip them after a minute. As you can see, we have been doing pretty steady as far as watch time goes throughout the years. So looking at our subscriber count, we were able to gain 13 subscribers this year. We started, we gained two at pretty much when my channel began in April. And as you can see, it's pretty much been, you know, we go up, we gain one, we lose one, gain one, gain one, lose one, gain one, gain one, gain one. We gain two, lose two, lose one, gain two, lose one. Gain one, lose one, gain one, gain one, gain one, lose one, gain one. Honestly, I feel pretty good about the way things are going because it seems to be, I mean, we tend to gain two subscribers for every one subscriber lost. And eventually, that will just stop happening and we will just hopefully just gain subscribers. So, as I was just talking about with the whole, I guess you can call it cheating the views thing and how it would help spread my videos. If you look at the graph, it looks like October 20th, pretty much after I really stopped watching all those views, you can see the impressions were soaring through the roof. That is what I was looking to go for, as we were able to get 36.5 impressions this year. And as you can see, our impressions have been doing fairly steady. Honestly, I feel like that is a very, very high number. I can't really comprehend that 36.5 thousand t times one of my videos has popped up in someone else's YouTube feed to me it just seems a little crazy so we finished the year with a 3.4 percent impressions through click rate and as you see at the beginning it actually was much much higher that's because I only had maybe five or six videos on my entire channel and as you can see and as I've started to head to kind of have more videos kind of test the waters of YouTube you can see it's kind of gone down However, sometimes there are those moments where it just goes up and everyone's just liking the videos. And, you know, I'm trying to I'm trying to figure out what people want, what people don't want. And I'm probably just going to try to focus on that. So our average view duration for the year 2020 was 1 minute and 37 seconds. I consider this to be very, very good. As you can see, at the beginning, pretty much through August, that view duration was pretty, pretty high up there. Since then, it's gone down. That is also, I think, in part because I've posted some shorter videos. I've also posted some not even 30 second long videos just showing glitches I've encountered in games, and those tend to be the most popular. So that, I mean, you obviously can't watch a 30 second video for more than 30 seconds. So that probably explains why that number has gone down, plus people just watching my video thinking it's going to be someone else because I guess I sometimes mislead them with titles. But, I mean, hey, it happens. So watch time from subscribers, the holy grail. I'm going to be honest, this, these numbers are not accurate at all. I really, really wish they were, but they're not because as I was, you know, watching all those videos, 
I was using them on subscribed accounts, so that's why the number is 63.9% and not subscribed is 36.1. However, hopefully in the future, I will look at these numbers and be proud because maybe for 2021, that's just what our regular numbers look like in the first place. So as you can see, the channel had a uh, pretty good year this 2020. Obviously, you're still looking to work, still looking to improve, and hopefully 2021 can be even better. And it is JBeebs signing off.